Micrometer Calibration Wipe all dirt from the measuring surface. Use a gentle spinning touch or use the thimble ratchet to close the micrometer. Check to see if the micrometer is zeroed properly. On this micrometer, a spanner wrench is needed to turn the barrel. A small hole in the barrel is used with the spanner wrench for calibration. The barrel is rotated to line up the zero marks on the reference line. After making an adjustment, open and close the micrometer several times, each time checking to see if the zero lines are properly lined up. If not, an adjustment will be necessary. This micrometer has a slightly different method of calibration. Make sure to clean the tips. Close the micrometer with a gentle touch or use the thumb ratchet. Check for proper calibration. If adjustment is needed, an Allen set screw can be found on the thimble near the thumb ratchet. Loosen the set screw with the Allen wrench. Now the thimble will move freely on the barrel. This thimble is spring-loaded, which makes adjustment a little more difficult. Position the Allen wrench so one quarter turn will tighten the screw. Hold the wrench and thimble in such a way so that the thimble can be adjusted and a pivot of the wrist will tighten the set screw. Once the set screw is snug, tighten it some more so it won't come loose. Open and close the micrometer a couple of times to check the adjustment. Make sure the zero lines are properly lined up. The calibration of this micrometer is only slightly different from the previous one. Here we can see the calibration is off by one half of one one thousandth of an inch. The thimble ratchet cover unscrews from the thimble. This exposes the thimble set screw. Loosen the set screw. This thimble is not spring-loaded. This makes calibration easier. Adjust the position of the thimble and tighten the set screw. Open and close the micrometer a few times to check the calibration.
Fully tighten the set screw so the thimble won't move. Install the ratchet cap. Check the calibration once more with the thumb ratchet. 